Okay, so first we're going to start with our FLIR E8 thermal imaging camera. I have it set up in thermal MSX mode, which basically is a really nice blend of your thermal image along with an outline of the actual image so you can see the image as well as the thermal signature. My measurement mode, I just have it set for, I'm gonna put it on cold, cold spot, so it will automatically go to the coldest spot within the target frame. Our color palette right now, we're gonna use rainbow. If we use iron, that is very, uh, is a high contrast, which works very well as well. And then we also have grayscale, which will work too. So we're gonna start off with our iron, or iron bow as they call it. Now one of the uh, tells of air leaks are gonna be cold spots due to the air inul inul infiltration. And another uh, tell is that you kinda get a feathering effect on surfaces where the air is buffeting against. So as we see here on my fitting, we do have some uh, dark patches there. We can bring my uh, let's bring our frame reference here. We see we have dark patches there. Okay, so that does look like uh, we very well could have air leaks in those areas. And then if you look on the the bulkhead there, where the uh, airline comes out, you can see the dark, the darker purple, and then it kind of goes to a, oh I don't know a lighter fuchsia, so to speak. And you can see that it's kind of uh, the color is kind of wispy there. So that definitely is a sign of an air leak. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and take a picture of this. I am gonna, actually I'm gonna take three different pictures. I'm gonna take it in iron, I'm gonna take it in rainbow. And rainbow gives us a really nice, you can really see the wisping of the air from the, uh, the bulkhead where the uh, airline comes out and where the air is puffing against it. You see the, the nice uh, dark uh, blue to where it kind of feathers into the lighter blue. And then we're going to look at it in grayscale as well. A lot of people like grayscale. Even though there's less uh, detail as such, it really uh, can cause your well, as you see, the dark spots really uh, pop out there, and it's real easy to see our differentiation in um, temperatures. So, definitely air leak. Definitely air leak there. You can see the uh, wisp wispness of the uh, color meshing between the, uh, the the darker gray to the lighter gray. Okay, I'm gonna stop, I'm gonna come back with my ultrasound equipment and we'll take a look at it, what it looks like and sounds like through the ultrasound detector.